Hey guys, Jason from Pro Dogs Dog Training. Hey, today I'm going to do a little bit of a unique video. I'm going to start working on tracking articles with Driven. One of the difficulties I have in my situation is I can't reach the ground. So shaping this behavior can be a little bit difficult for me. However, I've come up with a kind of a unique system where um, instead of laying the article on the ground and running the chance of the puppy picking up the article and playing with it, um, I've taken the article and I've zip tied it to a large piece of cardboard. Now, prior to this video, I've of course worked on shaping the down. I've also worked on uh, shaping the head down. When I teach my dogs how to do the long down, I teach my dogs how to actually down, but also keep their head down so they're not looking around and you know paying attention to other things. Plus, in tracking, it's really beneficial because a dog really shows a strong article indication. Now, my, my goal is ultimately teach the dog to stare at the article, not necessarily put their head down. I don't want to run the chance of the dog uh, bothering the article and losing some points there. Um, however, at this age right now, I'm just really looking for him to uh, strongly indicate it. I don't mind if he puts his head down. Uh, later, maybe I'll modify that a little bit. So, anyways, let's see how it goes. Hope you guys enjoy today's video. Take it. Oh, good. Take it. Show me. Take it. Hold on. Show me. Show me. Take it. Show me. Show me. Show me. Show me. Take it. Show me. 
Dick. Kevin. Kevin. Show me. Dick. Show me. guys let's break a couple things down here i saw in the video so i really like the progression here i saw uh towards the start he was just kind of throwing himself down on the cardboard and then towards the end i really saw him start to really indicate the article tell me hey this is what i'm supposed to be doing dad this is what i should be showing you and of course i marked and paid that one of the difficulties I've, i have with him is he's learned to jump and hit the end of the cup that's on the end of the stick and knock the food out. So you see at the beginning of the video, he's jumping, trying to knock the food out. Um, I kind of let that kind of go a little bit right now just because I want the animation later on down the light, down the road. Um, there may be some consequence for that. In other words, maybe we completely just stop training altogether. Um, there's some kind of negative punishment with that, but not right now. I don't care. I like the animation and I like what he's starting to offer. Plus, it's the beginning steps of shaping a new behavior and I don't want to convolute it too much and make uh, it too complicated for him not to understand something and get frustrated. So anyways, hey, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Uh, let me know what you think. Feel free to comment down below. Feel free to share this video. Hit that notification button. Thank you so much for tuning in and happy training.